This is one of the funnest video sequences from the, the uh, Innovation Forum recently that we talked about, I talked about, would you prefer a Doberman watching your business or a Sheltie? And I related that to the decisions I've had to make on my house. So this is a lot of fun, enjoy. This is my security system in my house. <laughs> the smart house, yes. So when I bought the house, we put, like this is 20 years ago, we put like sensors in in this first level. And then we bolted on a porch, that's a garage, but we put on a porch, metaphorically speaking, we put on a porch, we never secured it. We just kind of kept the, the, the windows secured here, but like we, I made a risk decision. I said, I'm not, someone could put a ladder against the house and climb in the top floor. And I said, that was a risk I was willing to live with for the, for the cost benefit that we've since put on to the outside. My, one day my wife showed up and she bolted on a ring thing on the outside. So now it's ring enabled, you know, so now we can see people and you know, all that. So it's interesting, it's cool. Um, here's my current security system. <laughs> so how effective is my security system um, with my sensors turned on on my, my bottom floor? So can I take my, and this, this two years ago, was my security system. He died at four. You know, a dog shouldn't die at four, but it did, and it chased, it was perfect with human beings. But put this in front of it, put a squirrel. I mean, you could not control this thing. A hundred pound Doberman running around with a squirrel. Um, a lot of fun, but it really makes me, made me think about how I secured my house because how effective was my first floor if he's in a cage? I just turned off, you turn everything off, just let him run the house. I mean, he can smell and he can, I mean, he's hyper alert to just chase the squirrels. So how many of our security systems just kind of chase squirrels and like, they're noisy and, and then, or how many of us have security systems that we think we have, we have uh, this and we really have this, you know, this is, this guy's about as vicious as a, uh, I mean, he just wants to lick you. I mean, that's, that's, that's how, that's how frightening he is. Um, so, <laughs> So I look at this as complexity. So how are you managing complexity? These are interesting decisions I just have to make in my house. But then we got to scale that into the cloud and we get the hosting facilities and 365 and all of this stuff goes on. And then we got governance and regulation. And we now got to run the systems. It becomes a big knot. 